Ever so often, I'm asked the question, what can I use for diabetes? What can I use for hypertension? What can I use for kidney disease? You know, those kind of non-communicable diseases. And usually, I'm just dumbstruck. I don't know what to answer. And it's not because I don't know or I cannot recommend something, but usually these diseases are lifestyle diseases. And so they require lifestyle adjustments and dietary changes today we're going to be talking about one local natural food that can be included in the diet to improve overall health we're going to talk about susumba or gully beans so here are 10 reasons why susumba berries are a great addition to almost any diet susumba berries have anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, and antifungal properties, and so they help to keep free radicals at minimum in the body, and because of this, susumba berries inhibit the growth of cancer cells. Number two, susumba berries, they support healthy kidneys. Number three, see what I'm like about them, Salawa? So these tiny berries help to lower the levels of glucose in the body and so they definitely help with managing lifestyle diseases such as diabetes. Number four, susumba berries because of the anti-inflammatory properties of the berries. This helps to discharge phlegm from the body and so a lot of times Jamaicans use this to treat the common cold or flu now the susumba berries they are very bitter and so you know i always say bitter to the mouth sweet to the belly and so susumba berries are blood cleansing now number six the gully beans are an excellent source of iron so for persons who are struggling with anemic issues or issues of anemia the susumba berries can be added to the diet to help to boost the levels of iron. Number seven, the gully beans or susumba berries help to expel uric acid from the body. And so in Jamaican folklore, they are used as a treatment for gout. And this is the leaves as well as the berries, right? Now the leaves and the berries are sometimes boiled together and they are given to persons who are perceived to have or who show symptoms of worm infestation. So this is a natural worm medicine. Number nine, susumba leaves are usually consumed as a treatment for stomach issues such as diarrhea. And the best part about the susumba berries is that they are alkaline. And so they are used in Jamaican folklore to treat issues including stomach ulcers. So whatever food you are having, you know, we can't overdo them. And so here are a few precautions about susumba berries. Number one the berries must be properly cooked the uncooked or young berries could cause poisoning and number two having too much of these berries could actually impact the kidneys negatively and so family we have come to the end of this video i thank you very much for listening for watching and please remember if you have not already subscribed go ahead hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and thank you very much for watching see you in the next video